The first tip to having a good serve is to grow and be tall. That helps. <laughs> Right now we're in my house in Santa Monica. These are my little signs here. Uh, you know, I read every morning when I'm brushing my teeth. This is every credential from every tournament basically I've ever played. Probably four or five hundred in here. I worked at a tennis club and he loved to come over there after school and play against the ball machine. He just loved that repetitive hit the ball, hit the ball. We never had any visions of grandeur with tennis at all. Probably not till he was 17 did we think, you know, he could go beyond college. Right now we're at the Farmers LA Open. I presently coach uh, Sam Query, who's the defending champion. I'm most proud of his commitment, his professionalism. You know, I want to win just as badly as anyone else. I look calm and relaxed out there, but inside I'm pretty fiery. You know, everyone says, oh, Sam, so laid back, but he's a competitive guy. Definitely has one of the best serves in the world. You know, you want to make sure you have a really loose arm, so I do a lot of exercises to keep my shoulder loose and string your racket at a looser tension. It'll be more of like a trampoline, get a little harder. Sam is a six foot six player that actually plays most of his tennis from the back of the court. He's a model of the way the modern game is played today. I was there in Bangkok at the time and, and uh, was in the hospital with him. He was very calm. He said, Mom, I've had an accident. I sat on a glass table. I hurt myself, but I'm okay. Fortunately, it missed like a nerve by like a millimeter. Otherwise, I don't think I'd be playing again. It really made him appreciate what he's doing now. He really understands how quickly something can be taken away. Give 100% effort every day. Give it all you've got, even if it's for 10 minutes. It's better to do 10 minutes of great work rather than an hour of mediocre work. I'm really looking forward to the US Open coming up and getting my ranking in the top 10 if I can. I love the progression that he's made so far because it's just been very steady, nothing flashy, nothing crazy. It just suits him well.